Okay guys, welcome back YouTube. This is Survival T, Survival T. I'm trying to move the camera around so you guys can see me. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, it don't look like it's going to happen today. Stupid stand here. Okay, that's about as high as it goes. Let me step, scoot this thing back here. Okay, you guys can see me now. Thank God. Okay, I, I'm making Texas toast with hamburger, and uh, I'm, which I got my oven right now preheating. You know, it should be done. And uh, this is my Texas toast bread. This is what my hamburger is going to go on. And uh, so let me get everything set up and uh, just watch the show and I'll be right back. Thank you. And always wash your hands. Okay, sounds like my oven's ready. Pop this in. Put it on the top shelf. Uh. Okay, now those are in the oven. So, <clears throat> get my hamburger. Turn this down to low heat. I already got my salt, my seasoning salt and pepper in here in the skillet already. And uh, get my hamburger. Well, wait a minute. I don't want to do the hamburger right yet. I want to do. God. Okay. I want to do my bacon first. Now I got to get rid of all the seasoning. Just rinse it out. It'll be all right. I'm getting ahead of myself. A little bit. Grab my knife. I always cut my bacon in half and uh, makes it easier to work with. See, just cut the bacon in half. Go lay down. Okay, now take my strips, lay them in this hot skillet. Awesome bacon right here. Okay, let that cook up. Then I'm gonna rewash my hands.
pretty hot. <laughs> the water was hot. Hope you all can see. Let me uh, see if I can bring these closer. See what. So you can all in backspace here or whatever. I don't want to show you the sink. Yeah. Okay. There we go. Now I got you all adjusted right now. <laughs> And uh, we'll get another pot on here. We'll make some mac and cheese. Go with this. I'm getting never getting nothing to work right around this place. And all you cook what you're going to eat. And uh, makes everything, make your uh, meal stretch when you do it this way. And uh, hold on, let me get my water. Okay. Let me show you it's my uh, mac and cheese I'm going to be using. Crafty kind right here, okay? Go. Puppy, go. I got my dog in the kitchen today. She's like snooping around. And uh, since we got rain now in the eastern woodlands, and uh, as soon as the weather breaks, I want to get out and I, I, I want to show you some more gear and uh, outside and uh, see where it goes, see where this bit at my uh, channel goes. Uh, I'm hoping it kicks off pretty soon, get more subscribers, and uh. Yeah, let me know what y'all think about my cooking. Uh, so give me a thumbs up. And always leave a comment down below. And uh, so yeah, always leave a comment. And this this ain't very hard at all to make. Uh, I'm just giving basic ideas today. Try something different. And uh, I've done eight, one of these here while, I've done made this stuff here a while back. I like it. But uh, the Texas toast is like $4 a box. 
a little high, but uh, besides eating that with uh, muscati all the time, you know, you can also use it for other things. And uh, it just ain't bread for biscotti or whatever you're having. And, uh, yeah, it's just put something different, you know, make something different for you. And like I said, I'm going to, um, I'm going to get some, I'm going to learn how to do some canning here. And, uh, and hopefully everything goes good with it. Okay, my uh, water is almost boiling, so I, I need to get a little bit of butter here to stick in there. The butter's not for flavor; it's just so the noodles don't be so the noodles don't stick. Okay, that bacon's almost done there. Butter. I'm using unsalted butter. like this. This is unsalted butter. It's pretty cool. Just going to cut off a little bit of it. Uh, let me see here. Uh, about three cups. Three, three teaspoons. About, oh, about something like that. That's all we need. Yeah, I, I don't cook with salt much. I don't I don't like salt in my stuff. I let other people salt their own stuff. <laughs> yep, that's how okay. Bacon's pretty done. Give you a little bit better look there. And this will finish cooking by itself. I'm going to check my toast. Just a second. this grease because I got a little bit more to cook run some cold water in the sink to cool down the grease when you stick it in the bowl it don't melt it so it'll be all right okay get out now I've got the rest of that uh, bacon right here. Skillet's really nice and hot. Pull all this part. There's a lot of fat bacon here. A lot of fatty pieces. But I, I really don't know. It should be all right. I'm going to rewash my hands.
Okay, it's almost time to get my hamburger on. Get this bacon. Crisp up. Okay, when that bacon get done, I'm gonna go ahead and cut a couple of tomatoes. Right here, my tomatoes. Okay. And uh you can just turn around here where you can see me. Okay. Get, I'm gonna get me a plate. I done washed them off so I thought they're, they're good. Slice them thin. Cut my onion now. Same way you cut your tomatoes. Okay. Like so. 
Like so. Here, I'll, I'll bring one closer so you can see it. That's my onion. Okay, now I'm going to turn this back around to where the stove is. My bacon is over here sizzling away on me. Now, if you uh, wear wedding bands or whatever, you, you want to take your jewelry off because uh, it costs seven ml of poison in, in your food and stuff. And you always want to take your jewelry off and wash your hands. As soon as I'm done with this pork, I'm going to rewash my hands and uh, wash the skillet out and uh, get ready for the hamburger. And it looks like my Texas toast is almost done. Okay, not quite yet on the noodles. Okay. <laughs> Check that bacon out. Okay. Okay. Get ready. Where's this out? Got my bacon over here cooling down. She thinks she's got to help today for some reason. Okay. There's the skillet. All nice and cleaned out. Put that on there. And I did put my bacon grease in a bowl and put cold water around it so it don't burn the bowl. Okay, get ready to wash my hands again. Okay, get ready for my hamburger. One hamburger patty right there, quarter pounder. That goes in. And my Texas toast should be almost done. I'm gonna check it in a second. As soon as I get this done here. My other hamburger. Wash my hands again.
grab me a mint. Or... Okay, I am going to add some black pepper to this, but I do not, again, I do not salt my stuff. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna check my Texas toast. Oops, door's falling off. Got that back up here. Uh, stove's like two years old. It shouldn't be doing that, but it is. And I don't know why. It's lost some screws or something out of there. But it's okay. It'll manage. Oh, yeah. Sure, this Texas toast. Get the pan's a little not hot now. So that's our Texas toast. And this is what the hamburger is going on. Noodles are done. Okay. Cancel that. Don't need that anymore. Another pot holder because when you pull that stuff up there, it's gonna be hot, so you gotta be careful what you're doing. Okay, get that back in there, bring this back over here, turn on low heat. I love this kind of cheese right here. It just melts all over the place. So I'm gonna take this knife here, and cut this open. The opposite way, cut away from yourself. Okay, then you take this and just pull it back. The part you cut, you cut, pull it off. Then you stick this down your noodles. Try not to get this cheese all over you. Or all over the stove. Okay, then we'll stir this up. There's your mac and cheese. There you go. There's your mac and cheese right there. Okay. Now I gotta put these hamburgers. Oops. 
It's going to be nice and thick. Okay. Cut that off. Now, when that hamburger's cooking up, I'm going to go ahead and make a sandwich and uh, get it all ready. And all I have to do is just put my burger on it. Okay? I got my Texas toast. Got my tomato. And Got my onions and my bacon right there. Okay. Then I'm gonna come over here. Back to macaroni. Give me some mac and cheese. Okay. Get that down. There you go. But since these hamburgers are done, I'm going to flip these back over here. And if you got kids, kids will really love this. So. I'm just showing you is what I put on this. You can put whatever you want on it yourself. And, uh. Make, make, it, your, make it your own way. She's trying to get into everything. She's jumping up on, trying to jump up on the table. What's that? That's you. And yeah, I'm fixing for two, not not for everybody. You know, there's only two people here. So I'm hoping this did think I was gonna make this for myself. All of this. Uh, I'm a big eater, but I don't think I can eat all this. Okay. Our hamburger is done. Slap this on there. Take this other Texas toast with your side cheese and everything side down. And there you go. Like, share, and subscribe. I hope you all like it. And God bless. Have a good day.